friends welcome to my channel Faisal physics cis point to point explanation examination point of view explanation in this video you will be learning about escape velocity and its derivation this topic is taken from intermediate first year syllabus telangana and uh, this is very very important question for board exam this topic is also available in cbsc class 11 physics as well as uh, in many other boards let us see the meaning of escape velocity. So the definition is the minimum velocity required by a body to escape permanently from the gravitational field of a planet is called escape velocity. Let's, let us understand the meaning of it. Consider this is a planet, for example, Earth, and there is a tower. From the top of a tower, an object is thrown with some velocity u, with some velocity u. So the object will move forward and then it fall it will fall like this now in the second case some more velocity is given to it the object will travel certain more and it will fall on earth and again more velocity is given again the object will move forward and it will fall on the earth still more velocity is given much more velocity is given then the object will move and it will not fall on the earth so what is happening here the object is escaping permanently from the gravitational field of a planet. So that minimum velocity which is given to an object so that it should escape permanently, that velocity is called as a escape velocity. Let us derive the expression for escape velocity. The final equation of escape velocity is V e equal to under root 2 g r. Consider planet of mass m radius capital R for example earth so on this planet an object of mass small m is kept then from universal law of gravitation the force of attraction between them is given by f equal to g m m by r square now we have to move this object from the surface of earth so we are doing certain work against gravitational field so that work done is given by w is equal to g m m by r now we have to move the object away from the earth so whatever the work is done here that will be stored as potential energy so to move that object we have to give kinetic energy equal to that of potential energy so that the object can move away from the earth so kinetic energy should be equal to potential energy so kinetic energy is equal to potential energy kinetic energy formula half m v square but for escape velocity we are writing v here and potential energy this work done will be stored as potential energy therefore we will write this equation here g m m by r so here small m is small m get cancelled rearranging v square equal to 2 will go there so 2 g m by r make it equation number 1 now we have to use the relation between small g and capital G that is given by G is equal to G m by R square. Rearranging this equation what we will get? Rearranging we will get G m is equal to G R square equation 2. Now put 2 in 1. Put 2 in 1. So V e square V e square equal to 2 in place of gm gr square by this r here square and this r get cancelled ve square equal to 2 gr ve equal to under root 2 gr so this is the expression for escape velocity v is equal to under root 2 gr we can write the relation between escape velocity and orbital velocity as v e equal to under root 2 v o because v o is equal to g r since v o is equal to root g r we can write v e is equal to under root 2 v o so this is the relation between v e and v o so from this we can make uh, one point that escape velocity is root 2 times of orbital velocity mm -hmm. 